Assalamu alaikum everyone. Hope you all are doing great. This is Fatima Abbas and uh, today we are going to make a wedding video invitation. Well, this tutorial is going to be for the beginners who don't know how to use the Adobe After Effects. We are going to use just the images and we are going to make the animation from that. So you don't need to worry if you don't know how to make animations, how to use Adobe After Effects. I'm going to teach you from level zero. Uh, and this one more important thing here is we are going to focus only a single part of the video that you can currently see in the screen right now. We are going to design the get together part in this one. And hopefully I will also post other tutorials as well in the channel. So now let's get started. We have already learned how to design the wedding illustrations. If you don't know that, then you can see the previous videos. I will add its link in the description as well. So I have opened the project in Adobe Illustrator and I have kept different uh, objects in different layers. So now I'm going to export it into PNGs. Uh, PNGs means the images with the transparent background. Uh, you can export the first one that is the background layer in the JPEG format. However, don't export others into JPEG. Uh, make sure you export them into PNG just like I'm doing right now. Next thing, I'm going to drag all of the images into the project panel of Adobe After Effects and I'm going to click on the create new composition. The width and the height will be automatically adjusted according to the dimensions of the images that you have, uh, um, you now drag into the project panel. Right below the project panel is the timeline panel. So either you can open the composition or um, you can simply drag the background uh, layer into the timeline panel and I think it will be more easier. So let's do this. Just to let you know that there are basic four types of things that you can do with your object in Adobe After Effects. The first thing is you can change its position. The second is scale, the third is rotation, and the fourth is opacity or transparency. With these four things, you can create any kind of animation in Adobe After Effects. I have dragged the curtains layer into the uh, timeline panel above the JPEG, and now I'm gonna press P, and uh, this clock will appear right below, and now we are going to change its position. So what I'm going to do is at 4 seconds, I'm going to click the clock and uh, it will have a little diamond shaped symbol right below the 4 seconds. It means that the final position at 4 seconds will be the position which is uh, uh, currently, uh, uh, which I can currently see in the screen. And at 2 seconds, I will drag it above and now I don't need to click the clock as automatically a diamond symbol will appear below the 2 seconds uh, when it will detect that the position has been changed. So this will be the initial position that is at 2 seconds the curtains will be right above that the um, viewer cannot view it and at 4 seconds it will come from top to down. One more important thing here is you just need to select both of these key points and you're going to right click and uh, keyframe assistant and easy A's. What it will do is it will make the transition smoother. Uh, you don't need to go into the depth right now, but uh, make sure you do it. It will uh, make your animation looks more good. So now I will drag the couple layer above the curtains and I'm gonna press the clock right here and that will be its final position and as the initial position now I'm gonna drag it to right like this and again I will select both right click keyframe assistant and easy ace 
to make the transition smoother. Now we are going to apply some effects to our objects. If you cannot see this panel, that is the effects and presets panel, uh, then you can go into the windows and you will see its name and you just need to click it and it will appear. Uh, from here we will go into the animations presets and then behaviors and wiggle rotation. I am simply gonna drag it into the curtains layer and it will be automatically applied uh, however i'm gonna change the wiggle amount to one degree because i just want a slight rotation in the curtains and uh, it will keep on happening in the background in the same way i'm going to apply the wiggle position uh, effect on the couple layer and I'm gonna decrease its wiggle amount, just like I did in the previous wiggle rotation. Now for the decorations, I'm gonna use the same uh, position and opacity transformation. For the boat, I am going to apply the position transformation and I'm going to uh, use the wiggle rotation effect. Um, and again, I will decrease the wiggle amount. Now let's create some light bulbs and for that I will go into the layer new and shape layer and I will select the circle from the top bar. You can also zoom in. And I will change its stroke to none and I will change the fill to yellow color. Now we will click on this add button, poker and bloat. And here we can change the amount. I'm going to take it to this one and again here uh, in zero. you will see a change in its shape. I'm going to increase its value. Mm. Yeah, it's good. Now we will copy the initial diamond point to here. And we will click on keyframe assistant and easy is. And now I will add a slight change in opacity as well.
you want to make a loop that is to repeat the cycle again and again simply press alt and click on this clock and write loop out just like this and you will notice that it will keep on repeating itself again and again i will do the same with the poker and bloat Now I will simply select the layer and I will copy paste it and I will move it to different positions to create multiple light bulbs. I forgot to record the rendering part so I'm gonna show you here how will you render your video so simply select the composition that you want to render and click on the composition from the top bar select add to render queue keep the settings same and click on render and your video will start to render so this is the final animation i have changed the clothes and uh, uh, the color of the floors according to the client's requirements however the other things are exactly the same hope you will like it make sure to subscribe to the channel and do hit the bell icon stay happy keep learning allah hafiz